Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to disable the tablet PC service in Windows 7. This will also work in Windows Vista. This will not work for XP because there, I'm pretty sure there is no tablet PC service in XP. Correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, okay? So yeah, first of all, now first before I show you, I'm going to tell you why you want to do this. Well, why would you want to? Well, if you don't have a tablet PC, and don't need those tablet features what's the point of having it so first of all we're going to click on our start orb as that's how it's known in windows vista and windows 7 control panel now i have mine under category but yours might be under large or small icons programs if you're under category program and features turn windows features on or off hit that or click that i mean It'll say, please wait. And we'll scroll down here. Tablet PC components. Now, normally there'd be a tick there in the checkbox. If there's a tick there, it's enabled. If it's not there, if there's no tick in the checkbox, it is removed. You click OK, it will, Windows will disable the service, then you can restart your computer. And also, we can disable from the services by going services.msc into the search box in Windows Vista and Windows 7 in the start menu. Click on services, let that load. It's a little bit slow. I'm on Intel Atom, so it takes a little bit. And we're going to go, oh, we're going a bit too far here. Tablet PC input service it has description enables tablet PC pen and ink functionality. If you don't need that, just simply disable it. Startup type disabled. Simply normally it's on automatic, I think, or automatically automatic delayed start. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe manual. Can't exactly remember. But we set it to disabled. Hit apply. Hit OK, and we're done. So if you like my videos, please do comment, like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.